Hey guys, we're back, and uh, sorry it's been a while, um, but I know there are a lot of things that came out, there are a lot of updates, um, both in the worlds of movies and video games. So today we're going to focus on video games. Uh, I'm going to be looking at two trailers uh, right now. Uh, the first is going to be for Black Ops 4, the Blackout introduction trailer, and then we're going to look at the trailer for Battlefield 5. Uh, so about Black Ops 4, a little introduction, if you didn't know, this game is going to be more just multiplayer centric so they're going to have a classic multiplayer modes I guess zombies mode of course and they're going to as we all expected they're going to implement a battle royale mode called blackout and that's the trailer we're going to watch for black ops 4 so uh, let's see what they show us Tacom, recon requesting attack chopper class Strike team are clear to deploy. Going off green. Check fire. Check fire. Mm. Kill all of them. We all love Black Ops for its combat experience. But imagine if we took that gameplay experience you know and love, and we spun it on its head. By making Battle Royale. We don't have to describe how Battle Royale works. These games are no secret. We play them too. But for us to even consider this kind of experience, it had to be unique and done in a way only Black Ops could do. What do you have for us, Treyarch? A survival game with the best, most refined mechanics in the world. Our signature controls and gameplay systems. And the kind of fast-paced action that only Call of Duty can deliver. All in the biggest map we've ever made. Hmm. And that is just the beginning. We're bringing to bear 10 years worth of Black Ops Universe features. Your favorite characters. Your favorite weapons. Iconic parts of your favorite maps. And we're putting them all in one place. A crazy collision of fun. And letting you navigate it with land, sea, and air vehicles. Okay. Something you haven't experienced before. Mm. This is something totally new. This is doing Battle Royale the Black Ops way. This is Blackout. Hey, hey. October. Interesting, interesting. So, it's a battle royale mode, it's not like they're trying to hide it, and they're kind of uh, addressing it head on in a way, like, everyone knows what battle royale modes are like, and I'm assuming that, you know, um, it's gonna just be fast paced Call of Duty action in a battle royale setting, like, in the Blops world, the Black Ops world, but I kind of wonder if... Um, uh, they're gonna tweak it in a way where it's still fair. Of course they would, right? Because in multiplayer, in Call of Duty, it's like, you get certain perks for number of kills. I'm assuming that isn't the case with Blackout. Um, but you have to wonder, like, what will they incorporate into this mode? Like, uh, like will you start out with nothing? Are you able to have a loadout? I know they have vehicles in there. You'll have a double jump. There's a lot of questions, but, um, yeah, I'm fairly interested to see how they put their spin on Battle Royale, and I'm actually wondering if Battlefield will also do that as well. I don't know. More news will come down the pipeline, but I, don't know, I always thought that um, a Battle Royale mode in the Metal Gear Solid 5 engine would have made a perfect experience. I'm a big Metal Gear fan, but uh, yeah, I mean, I, I don't know what to expect with that, but um, we'll see. Alright, so next up, we're reacting to Battlefield 5, uh, the official reveal trailer that came out today. I think they did a live stream. Um, so I don't know anything about this game, aside from I think they will have a campaign. But I'm excited to see what kind of setting they'll be in. Is it the past? Is it the future? Alright, let's see. Xbox logo. Limited exclusivity. Hmm. 
Wow. Not what I was expecting at all. Hmm. Oh, wow. Bring in the HUD, eh? Looks like you have your friends with you. It's probably more proof of concept for now, right? Looks great. Back to the past, if anything. Games play best on Xbox One. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pre-order now. Hmm. Very interesting. So, with Battlefield Five, it looks like they're they're going more um, classic, not classic, but like traditional in terms of like going back to the past. But I feel like that's a look at their multiplayer, um, like more of their multiplayer stuff. Uh, let me, I don't know what Battlefield 5 has to offer. I'm gonna look up some things right now, but yeah, I think they're also gonna have a big, um, what is it, like a big presence in the multiplayer arena because Battlefield has been kind of. Um, unique in how they did multiplayer like they had uh, more better control of vehicles whereas Call of Duty are more boots on the ground and you're fighting just as your soldier so I'm really curious to see what Battlefield 5 will bring to the table even given the fact that they're going back to the past going back to the past so I don't know both these games look pretty fun um, one is more like in modern modern era whereas the other one is like going back to like the past It'll be very interesting to see which one delivers uh, a better multiplayer experience. Or even just, um, it could be that both of them are really fun and you just have to choose. You know, vote with your wallet. So, in any case, uh, sorry I've been behind on videos once again. Uh, but what did you think of these two trailers? I know there's a lot of other trailers to kind of watch for Black Ops 4, but... Uh, it was just more looking at like what the big things that they're gonna, have, uh, I guess, give us. Um, but if I were to choose, uh, I think I would hold myself off before I even buy one because I haven't been playing much of Battlefield or Call of Duty for that mat, uh, for that matter. So I don't really know. I don't really have an opinion. I can't really make an informed opinion because I haven't been playing these games or these series lately. So. Let me know what you think. Let me know in the comments so that I can get a better idea of like, um, you know, how these franchises are doing. Uh, thank you for hanging out, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.